Okay, I'm gonna be teaching you Creeping Death by Metallica. Um, I already made a video for this, but um, there wasn't any tabs, so I just thought instead of tabbing the video, I'll just make a new one because um, I got a little bit better at teaching. So I'll just make make a new one, and uh, we'll go from there. So this is off the Ride the Lightning album, and it's gonna be in standard tune. Okay, so you're gonna start off with that intro. That I'm. Uh Okay, so what that is, it's just going to be, you're going to be, you're going to basically be down picking or alternate picking the 6th string, palm muted, whichever you prefer, um, to the 7th fret power chord on the, on the 5th string. And it's going to be 5 times, okay, so, or, whichever you prefer, I tend to alternate pick because it's a lot easier for me, so. Okay, then you're going to do that again, and then you're going to go 7th fret to 5th. Okay, then the next part that, um, okay, so you're gonna do your, it's gonna basically be the same thing except you're gonna strike the seventh fret power chord twice, then seventh to fifth twice. Okay, so. Okay, and then that little rundown. Okay, <clears throat> it's gonna be fifth fret power chord on the sixth string, to third, to second, to the E. Okay? Right? Sim simple enough. And then it gets into that uh, the main riff. Um, Okay, so what that is, um, it's just going to be, you're, you're going to be chug, chugging along the, um, the, the, the six string, palm muted, and then in, in between you're going to have a bard, uh, bard on the second fret, this, the fifth and fourth string, and in, in between each note, you're just going to be throwing in some, some, some palm mute. So the, so the pattern is this, um, I'll play it slow, okay? If you, if you know the song, it'll be a lot easier. Just follow, just follow the tabs. Okay, and then that little tail end there, that, uh, that's just, just going to be considered consistent, uh, <laughs> that's just going to be, uh, ham hammer-ons and pull-offs, okay? So it's going to be hammer-on from the second fret, fifth string to the third, and the word was consistent. Second fret power chord, hammer on to the third. Okay, hammer on again. Pull off to the second to open. Okay, so. That can get a little bit tricky if, uh, if uh, you're new to this song. And then just throw that in with uh, with the rest of the lick. Okay. Okay, and then it gets into that. I'm uh, I'm not gonna bother tab in this one part. There's no point. It's just gonna be second fret power chord on the fifth string to third. The second fret power chord on the sixth string. Then, then, then back into it. Okay, and then that next riff. Okay, so what that is is just going to be two two chugs on on the sixth string to 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 the G. Okay, so, and then you do that twice. And then you just, uh, you go to the second fret power chord on the sixth string and you palm mute that. Six times. Okay. 
all right and then it just goes back into um uh okay now the chorus the uh Okay, so what that is, is going to be E. Third fret power chord on the fifth string to fifth. Eighth to seventh. Third to five. Eighth, tenth. Back to the E. Okay, I'll play that slow. E. Three, five. Eight, seven. Three, five, eight, ten, E. Three, five, eight, seven, three, five, eight, ten, E. Okay? Sim, simple enough, pretty straightforward. Alright? And the last riff I'm gonna show you is the die riff. The Okay, so what that is, it's going to be seventh fret power chord on everything is going to be on the fifth on, on the fifth string. All the power chords are going to be on the fifth string. So it's going to be seventh fret, four chugs onto the sixth string palm muted, eighth, fifth, seventh. <clears throat> okay. That's the first part, and then the next part is four more chugs, tenth, eighth, seventh. Okay, and then it goes back into the first part. And then it goes eighth, tenth, seventh. Okay, so I'll play the whole thing now. Okay, one last time. Have fun with that.